It has now been some time since The Force Awakens awakened or reignited the interest of a whole new generation of fans, and they were quick to take to the net in support of their favorite pairings and characters. Here on Shipper's Guide to the Galaxy, we've already talked about the dominant ship that came out of the film for fans, namely Storm Pilot. But there is another ship lurking in the shadows that we need to get to know. This ship has been dubbed Raylo, the pairing of Rey and almost Sith Lord Kylo Ren. Turn back now if you are scared by even the vaguest hint of spoilers, and let's jump right into this. So we have Rey, our chosen woman from the planet Jakku, gifted with amazing piloting abilities and some awakening force abilities that are going to have young girls everywhere reaching for their lightsabers. She's on a quest to find her destiny and shape the lives of others in the process. While Kylo Ren is experiencing a similar journey, but on a much darker path. Descended from legends, he strives to leave their shadows while simultaneously living up to their legacies. His actions ultimately bring great tragedy to all characters, including himself, and set him in direct conflict with Rey. So these two are set up as antagonists. So why is there more shipping of the two of them together than of the obviously Disney-sanctioned romance of Finn and Rey? While the two share few scenes together, those they do are intense, such as an interrogation scene Scene crackling with energy as the two match the dark and light sides of the Force against each other. Rey and Kylo Ren's scene is also the first time the human face of Ren is revealed, and hence his human side. Ren also offers to instruct Rey in the art of being a Jedi, an offer that has launched dozens of AU fix the fanverse over. Fans of this couple are intrigued by the intensity of emotions between these two that have an edge of darkness to them, very different from Storm Pilot. This pairing is angry and at odds, however, there is also some some Loki syndrome when it comes to Kylo Ren, that being that he is a villain, but a troubled villain with a complex family backstory. While some may find him whiny, others feel the need to give him a hug, and with Rey seeking her lost family, she may just be the person to bring him back from the darkness and into the light, or vice versa, depending on which side of the force you want to pledge your allegiance to. Fix surrounding these two range from hurt comfort to angry smut to no small degree of non-con thanks to that interrogation scene. So those are some elements that people like, but what would make you not want to ship these two? Well, as mentioned, some find Kylo Ren whiny and feel no sympathy for his destined character arc and don't see any need for any character, let alone Rey, to console him. There are also some very strong hints and signposting about Rey's origin and lineage, which if it comes to fruition, could mean that her and Ren are related, which moves the pairing into the realm of incest, which not everyone is down for. One thing, however, is for sure. The actors Daisy Ridley and Adam Driver play off each other very well, and these two are going to share more scenes together, and all of their meetings are bound to be dramatic and full of passion. So even if they do end up sharing a bloodline, there may be no stopping Raylo. Raylo may not be for me, my heart only has room for Storm Pilot. However, is it for you? Which ship are you supporting? Or are you not shipping anything out of The Force Awakens at all? Let me know all that and more in the comments below. This was Shipper's Guide to the Galaxy. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for there are as many ships out there as there are stars in the sky.